want to try that? No I problem. I'm going to try it too. But she's got it. Marion Barry thought better of following the fire chief and one of his aides down this hole. Thanks for not. <laughs> The mayor's reason? He isn't trained. The people who are trained and assigned to the station also prefer the stairs. Look up and you'll see why. I mean, it's breaking away as we call it. This is uh, a double house, so it's a minimum of eight. And for all those people, only one shower works in the men's restroom. This sink looks as if it was installed when this 95-year-old firehouse was built. The bay doors are falling apart. There's a big hole in the floor under this fire truck with a temporary patch that has been there long enough, it might as well be permanent. One place the mayor didn't look at here at Engine 20 on Wisconsin Avenue is the basement. Now, if these firefighters were inspecting your home looking for safety problems, one thing they'd surely point out is water running down the wall behind this electrical box. You expect these kind of conditions and worse because when there's no money available, you can't uh, make a brick without, without, uh, without, can't lay brick without mortar. Uh, it's not a, good, uh, not a good scene, but again, with the Congress having cut our budget, what do you expect from us to do? The conditions extend beyond the building. This 23-year-old ladder truck turns heads as it lumbers through northwest Washington. It is supposed to be a backup piece, but it has been front line for eight months because the department hasn't been able to repair the newer truck. To get the full story, you have to take a close-up look at this truck. Parts of seats missing, broken windows, rust eating away at the metal, and compartments that can only be kept closed with the help of bungee cords. In all these harbor con some of these conditions here, the citizens in this part of town are absolutely safe among the safest in the country. The good news for the neighbors who complain to the mayor is that as bad as the ladder truck looks, at least it can respond to emergencies. Because right now at four fire stations in the city, the ladder trucks can't even move out the door. Dave Statter, Channel 9, Eyewitness News.